up peeps welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be cleaning my fish tank and probably time lapse because I don't know I like to do time lapse fills it just makes everything go faster because the whole process of actually cleaning a tank takes too long probably like at least a half hour to 45 minutes and again nobody wants to watch that so first what we're going to do is get all the supplies that we need which will include a hose a filter and clean hands <laughs> and that is about it I have five wait Dexter which is up at Blackmore I have Goldie which is this big goldfish that we want at a fair and I have brain which is this big oranda like goldfish the one with like the big brain head and I also have a fan tailed goldfish his name is fan and then I have a white one named Comet because he's a Comet goldfish. And I guess I didn't really get that creative on fish names, but honestly I don't call them by their name, so they're just goldfish to me. But they're my favorite goldfish, and it took me forever to get my tank the way that I needed to get it fixed up so that way they could stay alive. I probably went through like five or six goldfish dying because the, the HP balance and this or that or whatever wasn't right in the fish tank. But now it is, and they've lived. We've probably had, I've probably had my goldfish for a good two years maybe now but uh you know once you get it started and it's all good the ph is all good and everything like that then they just stay alive but we do need to do some routine maintenance and that's what we're going to do today here um are a look at the items that we need all right well that was fun wasn't it well i might as well get this started Come join me. All right, now this is the fish. These are my fish. They like eat food a lot. But before we start getting it cleaned, we have to um, use this bucket to use this vacuum hose to stick in the tank so that way we can suck all the poop out of it. Once we're done sucking all the poop out, we dump this out into the bathtub because we're outside wherever anybody wants to dump it out at. <laughs> and then we put this in it which is just to, you know, concentrated conditioner for freshwater fish. And then after that, we got to clean the filter out, which is behind there, and put this in it. So that way, you know, it's a carbon filter. It gets all the bad, you know, chemicals and other stuff. It feels weird. It doesn't smell like anything, so. Oops, I lost the top of it. How do it is? Oh, look at the fishies. How would I go tell them? But yeah, we're going to clean the fish tank. Ten times it is. Take this hose. Stick it in there. Make sure you don't hit any fish. And then suck it. It's so weird when they touch you. No, it really wasn't that dirty. The uh, other fish takes a really good job of it, so I'm good. Dump it. Oh, the fishy fell. I'm gonna take some water. It's not supposed to use soap, but uh, hurts the fish. Now, what I usually do first is I'll stick my hand in the fish tank to I try to gauge my the right temperature because I lost my other last thermometer that I used to have in the fish tank. Now I just have like one of those stickers on the side. So um, they don't really usually mind it plus they're cold water fish. It's not like they're tropical or you know they don't die off that hard. They're fucking fucking Spartan warriors I guess. I don't know. But uh, first what we got to do is um, shake this up pretty well. And since I got a few gallons, fill it up to like one of these little things. Pour it on in there. Go figure out what the temperature of the fish tank is and then get this started. The fish tank currently says that it's about 70, 68 degrees, so turn this on a little bit. That'll do. Damn it! It got hotter on me. Thanks, back to par. All kind of clean. The last thing that we're going to do is clean out the filter. Gross. 
Yeah. Now we gotta clean this nasty thing out. Look at that. Ugh. Ugh. This is the grossest filter in the world. Let's just go ahead and toss that. See in there all that well, but it is gross. We should let that soak because that's really nasty. And that's all folks, it looks like we successfully cleaned our fish tank. Well, for the most part, it really wasn't that dirty. It was more or less like routine maintenance. So, but the fish seem a lot happier. So, you know, that's all that really matters. But uh, thank you for watching. If you like this video, please comment, like, and subscribe and let me know what you think. I always can use feedback. Feedback's like the best thing for people to have when they do stuff like this. So, see you later. Bye.